on board your board. Let's get this over with. <laughs> well, look who's here. New recruits. Well, <laughs> let's fuck some shit up. Seriously, aren't you gonna thank him? Wait, what? Izuku, aren't you gonna thank him for saving you from expulsion? Uh, first of all, if it's expulsion, and why should I? No, oh, I don't owe him anything. You owe him your school life right about now. Uh, uh, What's his name? Was it serious? Are you sure? Cause it sounds like he really was. Uh, nah, I, I have no reason to thank him for saving me. I didn't need his help. I would have found another way. To what? I would have found a way to get back in the UA. You're serious? Yeah, seriously. It, besides, it would have been stupid of Eraser Head or whatever his name was to expel me. Seriously, you know how great my quirk is. I don't know from what we saw in the whole, uh, you know, uh, the quirk apprehension test. That was nothing. I was just having an off day. Really? Looks like you were trying your best, and Izuku looks like he was barely doing anything. Mm. Fucking bastard. Why is he have to get in my way all the time? Uh, uh you're right, Koski. I... I'm fine. Manada, what are you doing? Hmm? Oh, um, nothing, Midoriya. Just inspecting this poster. Hmm. Okay. But, uh, why? Can you keep a secret? It depends. Is it something perverse? <gasps> the audacity it is, isn't it? Yes. I appreciate your honesty. Now, move aside. What? Move. <gasps> You're gonna help me? Yes. I know you are, right? I don't care what anyone says. You're all right in my book. It's just, it just plugs the hole. You traitor! I said I was going to help you. I didn't say how. I, how is this helping me? Because I'm pretty sure the girls found out they would kill you. And, uh, yeah, you're welcome. That's bullshit. What's the worst thing that could happen? Well, say Jiro plugged her earphone jack into the wall and could hear this conversation. Uh, no, no, she would have never th thought of that. She has you as a classmate. As well as she is no idiot. Unlike you, as it seems. You call me? Yes, I am. You were foolish and very unhero like. Why did you even decide to rule here? Uh, well, I. Um. Girls. You're serious. Heroes are popular with girls, so I just thought. You are going to sully the reputation of heroes. If you continue down this path. Uh, mm, but I... Trust me, Mineta. 
It's not worth it. Uh, but I... I understand you being young. You're going through some changes, but still, that does not excuse such uncouth behavior. Uh, who put a stick up your ass? You're trying to be heroes, not peeping toms. If that is truly all we, you're... Maybe you should leave. Maybe it was wrong for me to try to save you as well. <laughs> Wait, what? I'm saying, if you were only trying to get with the girls, you should leave and forget about becoming a hero and follow a different profession. Uh, you tell me to give up? Yes. Unless you actually want to be a true hero. That we will actually want to be around. Excuse me? Do you really think a woman would want to be around a perv? Though, possibly at night time. But, no. People do not want to be harassed by a hero. Uh, so, what... Are you saying I should try to be a true hero and worry about my desires after the fact? Possibly. But what if I can't? Try anyway. Trust me. Yeah, I don't know. You kind of did. You just kind of did me dirty. I protected you. Uh, fine, fine, just <clears throat> please don't what don't what don't tell any of the girls why I try to do hmm all right. I won't. Jiro relaying everything. Everyone's pretty much like, wow, Izuku is pretty cool. Jiro's like, how did he know? How did he. Huh. Well, I did not expect him to realize how strong or useful my quirk is. So soon. As soon as uh, it's time for Hills vs. Villains, Izuku, he's pretty much, he has the same costume that Inko made for him. Only thing is, it doesn't fit right, considering his growth spurt. And Inko didn't have nearly enough time to really make any alterations. So... Not only is it clinging to him in certain places, he's trying his best to be as careful as possible so it doesn't rip and tear. <sighs> well, I... Hopefully this can get repaired if it does get damaged. As he just looks around, everyone's staring at him. Kirishima's like, doesn't that hurt? Down under? Yes. But this is what I have. Bakugo trying his best not to stare. Just for... Okay, you, why, why don't you... you... You should just change into your PE uniform. But my mom made this for me. It'd be rude if I didn't. 
least wear it once. I understand that. It's just... Stop staring. Pervert. I am not a... Don't let me in with those... Damn three fucking pervy musketeers. Well, the trio might be a quartet if they add you to their ranks. Even Manetta seems to be. As he sees Manetta with a bloody nose and drooling over some of the girls' costumes, he's trying, I suppose. As soon as the teams are announced, Oraka feels like she won the lottery. But, yeah. <laughs> but, yeah, there's an issue here. Because if Bakugo wanted to prove his superiority, it doesn't work. All he does is destroy Izuku's hero costume, leaving him exposed before the whole class. So, yeah, that was already stupid. And... Him just... Okay, okay, all my... Uh, t time out, call time out. I can still fight. You are wearing nothing! I can still fight like this. How? As he gets into a lower stance where he's like... No! Oh! What? This is staring at me! Stop looking, please. How am I going? How, how do I just try your best? All my like, hold on. Is he just uh, here? What? What are these shorts? I believe they're they may be your size. Um. All right. Boko's thanking All Might. <laughs> As, yeah, Recovery Girl has to check on the girls. Some of them might need blood transfusions. Oraka, she's already gone. But, but from uh, hearing the comms, the, what the hell did I miss? You know what? Bago still trying to blow up Izuku. He does. The only thing is, his explosions aren't doing anything. If Izuku actually does think it might hurt him, he just swats it away. Just regulating one for all like it's nothing. Huh. Seriously, this is very interesting. Seems like I have some type of healing as well. What are you talking about? Oh, yeah, I'm sorry, you're not noticing, but I'm actually training right now. What? I'm letting you hurt me to an extent so I can test my durability. What? <sighs> Trying to see how much pain or damage I can take from your explosions, as well as cranking up my quirk some more. What? <sighs> Let's just say I figured out that I can do this. Him flicking his finger and sending a shock wave straight to Bakugo and him flying right out of the building. Do you get it now? Ah, uh -huh. good. Him hang, oh, just to help a rock up fish. The only thing is, she can't stop laughing at Ida's seriousness. But it's Ida. Upon seeing this display, he's. What's so funny? Uh. uh nothing. He is trying his best to play the villain role, something he's not comfortable with, so he is doing well. I would prefer if you did not try 
to make light of the situation, please. <clears throat> Alright, I'm sorry. Good. Now, I'll make you something to use. Watch him punching the floor beneath them, and a shit ton of rubble is created. Rocco touches a pillar and pretty much tosses it at Ida. Izuku berating her for doing something so reckless, but okay, fine, I'll make do with it. Him catching Ida. Shock is nothing if not completely shown on Ida's face as he gets body slammed and Izuku touches the bomb, earning the win. When it comes to announcing who's the MVP, it's actually shared with Ida and Izuku. Oraka seeing is doing something that reckless, and Bago doing something so, mm, pretty much stupid. Or at very least, not wanting to come up with a plan. But luckily, Izuku does receive some flag too. How he said, yes, he's technically using this test as training for himself just to see how much damage he can take. Which Momo does. Like, but you did put on a good show. Or I'll go, like, what, what are you talking about? Good show. What, what do you do? Oh, yes, right. You were dealing with Ida. So, you didn't see any of that, did you? What? D didn't you... Why didn't you question the fact that he had shorts on? I just thought... Oh. Yeah. Oh. So, wait, so he... Bago destroyed his hero costume. There was nothing left. Are you serious? Yes. And you m missed it. Sorry. Oraga feeling very, very pissed. But soon Izuku berates everyone, at least the girls wise, for trying to turn him in to an object, just ogling him. Man, I was like, oh wow, I thought he was going to be okay with it. We are here to become heroes. I wouldn't just berate you for being a little perverse. Everyone get gets a speech. Uh, you're serious? So you're being fair? Of course. Of course I'm being fair. It's called gender equality. Okay, yes, I think I like you more. Is all my Tim just. Hey, Midoriya, you've changed. Hmm, well. Thing. Sometimes change is good. But other times it can be disastrous. Meet with me after school. Everyone thinks he's in trouble. It's like, wait, what the hell did he do? It's like, no, 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 it's just something he and I need to discuss. As he go further into depth of the changes he's experiencing from his hair, eyes, his whole shebang, it's pretty much like, okay, so from what I can tell, this isn't one for all. I mean, yes, though I do have a buff form to transform into, it's, this isn't, you know, <sighs> you're right, hmm, I, well, that just begs the question, what to do now? Uh, 
I don't know. If you have lots of quirk, it's... I don't know what, really what to do. I don't know if one for all unlocked it or it was just dormant or not. But in that case, uh, all might. Do you want your quirk back?